the number of ways of distributing 15 identical balloons, 6 identical pencils and 3 identical erasers. So 15 balloons, 6 pencils and 6 erasers among 3 children, obviously not identical children, that would be brilliant, such that the each child gets at least 4 balloons and 1 pencil. So 4 balloons plus 1 pencil. So 6 identical pencils and 3 identical erasers. Sorry about this. I'm going to erase this. So 4 balloons plus 1 pencil. 4 balloons plus 1 pencil. Each of them definitely gets this. And then what are the ways of uh, get at least 4 balloons and 1 pencil? How do we distribute the, the rest? So well, let's think about this. Four balloons, one pencil, four balloons, one pencil, four balloons, one pencil have been accounted for. The balloons are indistinguishable. So to are the pencils, so to are the erasers. So out of this, you can select any four, any four, any four, given it away. One, 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 given it away. So four plus four plus four, 12 out of the way. One plus one plus one, three out of the way. That means after doing this, we have three balloons, three pencils, three erasers. Practically, we only have this to give away, not, not anything else. The children are not identical, the balloons are identical, the pens are identical, the erasers are identical. And so, this again is tricky because I could put one balloon, one pencil and two erasers. One remaining here, nothing there. I can even give nothing to the third person, it's still tricky. I have three balloons, three pencils, three erasers. How do I distribute this? Each one, we cannot say goes into one, each one does not have three choices because the balloons are identical. That becomes an issue. So what do I do? I think about only three balloons. Child one, child two, child three. And now I say, hey, I could have a scenario where all three go to one child. This is three, zero, zero. So this 300 could be 300, 030, 003. Two of the children get nothing. That means one gets all three. 300 is one possibility. Now, only one child gets nothing. The other two get something. Out of the three, other two get something. So it will be one and two. So one here, two here, no other possibility. So this could be 1, 2, 0, 1, 0, 2, 2, 0, 1, 2, 1, 0, etc, etc, etc. That's one possibility. Now the third combination, everybody gets something, nobody gets 0. That means you've got to be 1, 1, 1. One balloon, one balloon, one balloon can be done in only one way. One balloon, two balloons, zero balloons can be done in six ways. Why? It could be 1, 2, 0, 1, 0, 2. 2, 0, 1, 2, 1, 0. 0, 1, 2, 0, 2, 1. 1, 0, 2 being rearranged. 3, 0, 0 can be done in 3 ways. 3, 0, 0, 0, 3, 0, 0, 0, 3. Now we found out the number of ways in which we can distribute the 3 balloons. That can be done in 10 ways. We still haven't touched our erasers and our pencils. But here that becomes simpler. Because we put 3 pencils. That can be done in the same 10 ways. 3 erasers, same 10 ways, 10 ways of distributing balloons, 10 ways of distributing pencils, 10 ways of distributing erasers, 10 into 10 into 10, 1000 totally. That's the answer to looking for. Excellent, excellent, excellent question.